in this video we are going to be determine the full adder by making use of 4 cross 1 marks or subtractor full subtractor by making the 4 cross 1 marks okay it means that i want to reduce the size of the marks with one variable okay it means that instead of uh, three uh, selective lengths you have only two inputs and one input you will use at the input end okay so you have to adjust like this okay so uh, again we have to find it out uh, the majority gate function so i will tell uh, you how we can do it and now come back to the truth table of the uh, full adder okay so these are the eight combination you can see so for three variables i am considering x y z and for that the output is going to be one is going to be sum which is, uh, one is going to be carry so we have to add three bits you are getting zero zero in the first zero location for zero one you will going to be one zero sum is going to be one carry is going to be zero again you have to add this thing zero plus one is one one plus zero that is going to be sum is going to be one and carry is going to be zero again zero plus one this is going to be one one plus one this is going to be one zero so carry is going to be one sum is going to be zero again you have to do for this one one plus zero this is going to be one one plus uh, zero this is going to be one no carry so like this you have to be add okay so suppose uh, one plus zero this is one one plus one this is going to be two 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 means one zero so carry is going to be one sum is going to be zero again one plus one this is going to be uh, two two means one um, one zero or and again uh, zero plus zero that is sum is going to be zero and carry is going to be one on the basis of this we have to generate the function of the uh sum okay so for sum what is the sum of product form this is going to be 1 2 4 7 so like this this is going to be okay and this is simply nothing but this is the xor if you will solve this uh, this by using the k map you will be get a uh, xor of this thing a uh, three variable so i am not going to be tell you how we have to make this circuit i simply want to reduce the size of the mux by one okay so how we can do that simply we have to make it x y okay x y y bar again x bar y again x y bar and x y like this you have to make and this is something uh, this is z and this is z this is z bar and this is z so again you have to put all possible combination of these two 0 1 0 1 1 0 1 0 1 1 1 1 and you have to put the this combination of this z okay this is going to be 0 this is 1 this is 0 1 zero one zero one okay so you will get all the uh, possible combination for all values now select whatever it is there okay so i'm going to be select one over here okay again two again i'm going to be select this thing uh, four again this is going to be seven okay so what it is going to be there this is going to be z this is going to be z bar this is z bar this is z okay and if you want to make a circuit uh, four cross one circuit by making the use of this thing so how you can make it you simply select like this okay make four lines and you have to make one output okay so how you can say this is the four cross one max and you have to z z bar z bar and this is uh, z again this is x and this is going to be y this is the output so like this you can make the four cross one max for the full adder this is for the sum okay now come back for the carry for carry what you need to be do you need to be consideration of uh, this this is going to be 3, this is going to be 5, this is going to be 6, this is going to be 7. Then the function of the carry is going to be 3, 5, 6, 7. Okay. And now from the, the reduction of this variable, how you have, you have to select 3 from here and 5 from here. And uh, this is what is this even? This is 6 and this is 7. Okay. So this is going to be 0 here. This is going to be Z. This is going to be Z and this is z plus z bar that is going to be one okay so zero z z one and this is x and y you are going to be get at all output four cross one so how you can get the output four cross one one max you how you can implement four cross one max by making the use of uh two uh so this is how you can generate a carry by making the use of four cross one max okay now 
majority function is something number of one is greater than number of zero suppose you have given one example like one 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 zero zero so what is this the majority function yes this is the five bits are there but uh, number of one is greater than number of zero in this literal okay so this is uh, majority the output is going to be one here so majority means number of one should be greater than number of zeros okay you have given a three input majority function how you can do this simply you have to be check it out whenever the number of one is uh, greater than zero okay like in three one zero two one like in five one zero two one again six seven the number of one is greater than number of zero then it is going to be a majority function so the whatever the implementation of the carry for the uh, full adder is going to be sim same for the uh, majority gate function also okay so the output of the majority gate function is same so now you can conclude for the majority gate function it is going to be same for the carry for the three bits okay so now you can see this thing now for the full subtractor similar things we have to do okay here these are the four all it possible combinations for three bits and we have to create the difference and borrow okay so zero minus zero this is going to be zero zero minus zero this is going to be zero so borrow is zero uh, difference is one zero minus zero this is going to be zero and zero minus one so it means a negative number is there you need to be take borrow okay so this is borrow is going to be one and again the difference of this is going to be one again you have to be zero minus one this is going to be again going to be create one borrow and uh, uh, again one minus zero this is going to be one so like this you have to complete the entire possible uh, table okay again my motto is not here to uh, uh, teach you the differences in between this thing uh, we have to we create uh, one max four cross one max from this function so what is the function from this table we can generate the function for the difference so this is going to be one and this is going to be uh, one this is going to be two and this is going to be again four and this is going to be seven okay so again this is the function of the xor okay if you see now so this is the function of the xor for the three bits okay so on, now what you have to do you have to use the reduction techniques okay again you have to select one and again you have to select this thing uh, two and again four again seven and this is going to be something called uh, this is going to be again uh, uh, z and this is z bar z bar and again this is z okay so z z bar again z bar again z this is x and y and this is going to add the output so this is output is going to be the difference okay it will this is going to be tell you the difference okay so uh, always uh, keep in mind um, that So here you can say bar is there so for this bar you need to be generate uh, uh, you need to be take the help from one not gate or you have to be put two cross one marks to get the uh, uh, not gate of the complement of the z okay back to the borrow okay so for the borrow what is going to be there it is going to be again you have to see this thing okay this is in the borrow and you have to create the function from this one this is going to be one this is going to be two this is going to be three and this is going to be seven so again u one two three okay and seven so this is the function so uh, you have to make it uh, mark all those things okay one and again two again this is going to be three uh, three this is three again this is seven okay so this is going to be z this is going to z plus z bar this is going to be one this is going to be zero and this is going to be z again so z one zero z so this is going to be there at the output okay so this is uh, this is the output y okay this is x y so output y is there so this will tell you the difference okay so by making the use of this thing you can generate the four cross one marks for the full adder and the subtractor thank you